Hello, and welcome to a new series, Crisis. Okay. I have actually played this kind of game before, but the third one. I never played the first or the second one, um, and I never even beaten the third one. So I really don't know what I'm getting myself fully into. Um, let's see, difficulty level... I don't know what this fully means. Oh, okay. Driver controlled gun, simple binoculars, enemy speak English. Driver's a controlled gun, simple binoculars, enemy speak English. Normal binoculars, enemy speak English, and no crosshairs, no grenade warning. Normal binoculars, enemy speak Korean. Oh, okay, so let's do hard. I don't fully know. I know like it gets very crazy in the end. This seems like it's more normal enemies, because literally, I guess they speak Korean. Um, that's pretty cool, though. That instead of like you actually understanding them, no matter what, you actually don't. Like if you go in the hardest mode, I think that's kind of cool, because then you really have no clue of what's going on or what they're saying. I don't know what I'm fully going for. I remember. Crisis 3 was more as a linear. I don't know if Crisis, the first one, is a lot more open world, so we'll see. I really don't know what I'm getting myself into. I'm quite excited, though, because I really want to be one to play this. Okay, seems like we're in some sort of war. So, it seems like maybe we're at normal times, but we're introduced to um, new types of technology. Seven days later. Lingshan Islands, Philippine Sea, August 14th, 2020. Hey, that's two years ago. <laughs> probably when this game was made, it was probably like maybe 10 or like 8 years ahead, but uh, now it's like pretty caught up. Command, this is Sky Chief, Red Angels 25, bearing easy. Getting some radar. You know what I always thought would be kind of funny? Um, the idea of. Like whenever they go ahead of time and they don't That's go far enough, team. but once it gets there, into your time, it's like, it's like, did they somehow get it accurately? And I know in this, it's like, nah. But I always thought that, that would be funny if like stuff is accurate because they, th that type of stuff happened in like um, Family Guy and The Simpsons, even American Dad, I think too. And it's kind of funny. Okay, listen up, gentlemen. Intel reports a significant military presence on the island. We have the element of surprise, so let's use it. The North Koreans can't know we're here. They won't even know what hits them. <laughs> Can it, Psycho? Pay attention. This is a covert operation. So you're a prophet. Our job is to locate and evacuate. We're not at war here. Not yet. Well, oh, his name is is actually Psycho. Still alive. Chester. Who's the guy in the back? Dr. Rosenthal a week ago when the Korean military locked down the island. Two days ago. We picked up a distress signal from the team's research vessel. Someone down there wants to be found. Raptor team, we're beginning approach. Stand by for All right, gear up. Masks on. Once we clear the plane, form up on me. Shoots on my mark. So I wonder if I'm going to be with these guys all the way, or is it going to do like one of those scenarios where we get go, go, basically go. murdered? And like me and this guy are going to be the only ones left, because then the guy in the back didn't even say a word. Right now we only have Prophet, Jester, and Psycho. Whoa, this might be open world. Who knows? We'll see. So, Jaysock's got us chasing archaeologists now. Yeah, this will be a cakewalk. I've heard of this guy. He must have found something big to buy all of this heat. Whatever. Fifty bucks. Not playing these tonight yet. Heat. Lock it up, team. Stay focused. We got limited intel going in. Upcom's being moved to the USS Constitution. Until they're five by five, we're on our own. Thing is, it might Shoot be open world. Command. We'll see. Go. What the hell? You see that? No man's here. He lost his chute. 
My suit's gone. My damn suit is gone. I've got no main, no reserve. Keep it together, kid. You're over water. Your suit should absorb the impact. <laughs> One cool thing is, I was looking at um, controls or whatever stuff, so I could have things pre-readied, and you can actually be a girl in this, which is pretty cool. Because usually you don't get to do that type of stuff like in the older games, unless like it's meant to be. Hello, turtle. I kill. Well, I didn't think that would kill him, but I guess I can. Well, at least one thing approved. I can't harvest. Sweet. Still no word from Aztec. No man. Rendezvous with Jester and head to Aztec's location. Check okay. Your objectives display. Engaged. Rendezvous with Jester. All right. Whoa! I am fast. I think it's a good idea to say that there's someone's been camping here. Make sure your silencer is attached. Oh, I remember this. This was in the third one. Oh, that's cool. Careful, man. I really like the idea. Let's see if I can get a scope on this bad boy. There we go. That's better. No, I'm here. Whoa, I'm dead. Wow, okay. We didn't die. Okay, so I heal over time. I'm honestly gonna take this. Might as well have more than one gun. Be safer. I will say though, it's kind of hard to use it appropriately because, like, the touchpad's a bit awkward when using it, but it's not too too bad. All right, almost near Jester. The 
prick is that? I'd rather use it when I get there. Oh boy, they have been destroyed. Are we going straight into the enemy? Wow. I don't like this, man. I can tell. Wow, he looks very happy. What's Aztec status? Dead, boss. Damn it. What the hell is going on out there? I don't know. But I don't think we're alone out here. What have you got? KPA? Negative, sir. We got four dead Koreans. But there's no way Aztec killed them. Something else took these guys out. Put their bodies up bad. Alright. Pay your respects and move on. Rendezvous at the landing zone. What about Aztec, sir? We're just gonna leave them hanging here? Negative. I'm gonna vaporize. We can't allow the Koreans to get their hands on that suit. Stand back! Damn it. I never get used to that. Oh, that is weird. Jester, take care of his equipment and cover our tracks. Nomad, move out to the LZ. You got it, boss. I'm on it. No clue. Hold on, I'm seeing movement ahead. Switch to cloak mode. KPA patrol. Deal with them. Nice and quiet. Wow, they do not die easily. What the frick was that mode? Also, I thought for sure I shot him in the face, too. Hold on. I'm seeing movement ahead. Switch to cloak mode. Yeah, that can wait. I lost my freaking cloak as soon as I caught up. Where you go? I find you. Where's your gun at? I want it. Almost daytime. Oh, 
controls are so weird. I just lost our comsat to JSOC. Our whole tactical display's down. The KPA must be using a GPS jammer to your location. Find it and take it out. Copy, Prophet. I'm on it. Sorry about that. Um, only scam calls. Thought it was important. Really need to fix that issue. Damn. I hate when I get to a checkpoint because it gets incredibly laggy, and this game is all about moving fast. I thought it would kill him instantly. Alright, I think that's going to be it for this episode, so I hope you enjoyed this like I did, and I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye!